first two days you played good cricket, you know, you were in a pole position to win the game. How frustrating was it with the last two days? Yeah, it was, it was quite frustrating. I mean, um, we, we got ourselves in a good position to, to try and win the game. Uh, the wicket was, was really good over the four days, so we knew it was going to be hard work. And um, Two of their players obviously got in and, and cashed in really and, and played very well and made it hard for us. And yeah, it's just a pity we couldn't, we couldn't um, stamp home our, our authority there. Um, three wickets in the first innings, a five, a five for in the second innings. You've got to be happy with the way you bowled. Yeah, look, I'm, I'm happy with, with the wickets. Um, still think there's a, there's a lot of improvement to be done there. I think my um, the amount of runs I went for is a bit too much. Um, personally, I, I'm obviously a bit disappointed with that, but happy to, to be able to take some wickets. Um, and yeah, hopefully I can, I can get it right for the next few games. Congratulations on passing 300 first class wickets, that's another milestone. Yeah, look, I mean, it's been a while coming now. <laughs> um, yeah, it's a good milestone to, to reach. Um, hopefully, I can kick on and get some more. To the sun. How will the team be looking back to bounce back in tomorrow's game against Derbyshire? Yeah, look, tomorrow's a massive game for us. Um, we've obviously lost our first three games in the T20 comp, so we, we're looking to, to set things right tomorrow. Um, obviously, it's a bit tough after, after spending four days in the field, um, but I think we're just going to have to lift ourselves tomorrow, tomorrow evening and, and execute our skills better than what we have been over the last three games, and, and hopefully it's good enough for us to come out on top.